We're here today because we believe in the same thing. We believe in fairness and dignity at work for all Victorian families. Sadly, those currently holding the reins in Canberra don't believe in these things and there wouldn't be a family in Victoria that hasn't been dudded by work choices or doesn't know somebody who's felt its sting. Work choices, I'm sure you'll agree, is a disgrace for a whole range of reasons, but no more so than it targets the most vulnerable in the workplace, the cleaners, the security guards, the retail assistants, the waiters and the caterers. To your enormous credit, to your enormous credit, the Clean Start program, which I launched a year ago, has been an enormous success. I understand that the LHMU started this campaign because of the pressures felt due to cost cutting. We're happy to launch this campaign because we know the dangers of a system built on the back of the working poor. The last thing we want in this country is an industrial relations system where people are clamouring over themselves to get to the tip jar to pay their bills. That's the American system, it's not the Australian system and, and we, we should, should reject, reject such a system, system here in Victoria. Victoria. And that's certainly why we are pleased that property owners, contractors, cleaners and the LHMU are working to build a better and sustainable future for your very important industry. I understand that the CBD's top six cleaning contractors, who represent about 70% of the city's cleaning workforce, have now signed the responsible contracting policy. This has stabilised to some degree endemic problems for cleaners, such as cuts in hours and job insecurity, but more needs to be done. <laughs> what your campaign, your very important campaign, has achieved is a framework for dignity at work. In turn, the Brumby government is determined to support an industry based on fair contracting and indeed reasonable awards. That's the difference between Liberal and Labor. Labor is about investing in our future, maintaining a strong economy and at the same time protecting the fair go. Our collective and immediate task is to make it crystal clear that just as Victoria has benefited from its belief in dignity and fairness in the workplace, Australia needs a federal government that believes in the same. Good luck with your campaign. Yeah!